welcome back to the game. The puck is about to drop as the skaters glide into position. And so what the fans anticipate now unfolds the old matchup. Simult, no team worth its name is going to let that go. Play stopped. It's Ray Ferraro time. Right from the beginning of warm-up, there's been a little animosity that you can almost touch between the two teams. When they get together, it's always a physical game. Many thanks, Ray. Using the point, he's got it. And he is shooting. He was standing in the lane and got some of it. The Canucks waiting back in their own end. From the outside, good save there. He is hooked, he kind of shook it off and continues to play. There'll be a penalty. Vancouver's two-minute penalty is a minor and the call is hooking. Minnesota's power play will have its first chance of the game. Vancouver's got a face-off win. This is a power play earned in a scoreless game. Their power play can now get them on the board and give them a lead. Blockered away. Free puck thanks to the roadblock. Dumba's hooked on the play. There will be a penalty. On the delayed penalty, the change is made, and the extra man is out there. Puck loose. Strong defensive play by Edler. Vancouver's roster goes down by one here. At least briefly, a minor penalty for hooking. The play goes to 5-1-3. on three. A terrific advantage coming up. You're right, Doc. This is a big advantage here. A 5-on-3 on the power play. It's one you have to capitalize on. Knocked off the puck. Good job defensively done there. That takes some pressure off with that defensive play. In that defensive zone, an important play. Moving it to Tanev. Is able to move on in. Missed on that. Score! A power play goal, and it's a biggie. Minnesota's ahead by one goal here in the first period. A lot of time still left to play, but getting one and breaking the tie was huge. Final goal scored on the power play by number 12, Eric Stahl. Terrific determination by Koivu. Looks ahead to start something. And he steps across the line. Gives it on a cross from the point. Minnesota's in their own end, hoping to make a play to center. Looking to Pearson. Let's it go. Good save there. Crosses that line. One timer deflected off the blocker. Skill play by Ryan Suter. Directing that one to Parisi. Lifts the stick and steals it. Minnesota's in control as they travel up the wing. Smart recovery by Spurgeon. Cut that pass in his own end. Not a long pass, but effective. He's got it. Couldn't get through and retain possession. Solid work there by Spurgeon. From behind the net. Really good cut of the pass. Skilled play by Raz. He scores! A little under eight minutes still to play in this period. And so with the scoring of that goal, their lead is a pair. And they take that neutral zone face off. Has it picked up. The Canucks are moving the puck in their own end. Tremendous hit. Historically, these two teams play very physical games. Not tonight. This is virtually a no-hitter. Propelled to Stetcher. A howitzer. Save! Oh, great reaction there. To Felino. Snapping a pass to Eriksson Eck. Laid on to Levo. In with it now. Save! Pass comes to him from the crease. 
slid to Erickson Eck. A shot. Wonderful save. He was hovering right over him. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. What a hit that was. That play there should certainly heat things up. On to Levo. Got it in his own end. Nearing the final minute. Scooped up by Erickson. In the first period. If they can get organized, maybe time for one more attack before the end of the period. Out in front. He scores! Just before the period ends. Vancouver has got that one. Now what? Let's it go. Save there. First period has come to a close. Some plotting of strategy for the second in one dressing room. And maybe some continuation of what they've done. The only strategy in the other. Markstrom's had a difficult contest, and here is an example of that. For now, he gets a rest. So do we as we head to break. Second period about to begin here. Let's take a look back at the first. What stuck out for you? All right, now there's some misbehavior. I don't know if we're going to have to fill the penalty sheet here. Well, I hope so, Doc, because this game needs this jolt. A lot of goals scored in that first period. Let's see if there are a lot in the second, and maybe more equally divided. Pass attempt to Brown. Passing one off now to Felino. Trying to go to Pearson. Vancouver's along the wing at center ice. Scooped up. Slid back across from one point to the other. Takes it to the corner. Snaps it to Edler. Great block. Back at the point now. Pitch to Edler. It's blocked. Puck controlled now by the defense. Minnesota's controlling play now up the wing. Terrific determination by Edler. Puck is thrown to Besser. That puck's lose a good defensive play. Pitching it to Eric Stahl. Two guys together with force. Big force. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. Got a piece of that one. Chip to Besser. Lots on that to Berchi. Pitching this one to Eric Stahl. Gets in, looks over his options here. He wore that puck on a hard shot. Minnesota's setting up an offense from the wing. Got that pass in his own end. Loose puck due to the play by Hutton. Twist one. Gathered up by Hutton. All a part of generating an offense. A little pass off from the goal. The Gronlin. And now it's directed to Pedersen. Rister from the slot. Pad save. Ooh, tough one there. Moving it to Aber. Gains the zone. Pass. He scores. Four goals in a row for the same team. Minnesota's got a large lead in this game. Let's see if they can build on it or whether they'll start to get conservative. And they won the neutral zone faceoff. You win that, and you don't have to chase. They chase you. What a save. Now that's a solid save. And they've got it again. What a tremendous hit. That's a solid hit. Nowhere to lean against the boards there. Minnesota's moving the puck in their own end. Couldn't get his way through. Taken behind by Beagle. Thinking attack here. Minnesota's going to watch this game film over and over again and tell their team this is exactly how we want to play. They haven't had one hiccup tonight. 
Up the wing still with possession and with hope. Pass cut, strong play. Breaks free. Good defensive read with that one. When you have a lead, you want to make sure plays. They've done that most of the night. This is not the time to try a hope play. Looking to Rask. Outstanding pass. He's got it right off that right wing. Strong play there by Edler. Got that one ahead at center ice. A shot. Collected by Brown. A superb hit. A great hockey play there. He's looking to change the momentum of this game. The Canucks, in their own end, have control of the puck. And in flight over the line. Got that pass in his own end. Directing that one to Eric Sinek. Maybe he can change the tide at center ice. Gathered up again by Brown. Took care of that one. Snapping a pass to Hutton. Passing one off now to Levo. Puck needs to be first. Offside. And they've won the faceoff. That puck is loose on good defensive play. Shoots one. Takes that pass. Here we go. Well, they got to be a little tired after these first two periods of play, so they'll get a rest as we start to think ahead toward period number three. Don't forget to check out tonight's game highlights. Full cool season. Interesting action in the first two periods. I wonder what we'll get as this third period has begun. Tanev's going to the box. It's a tripping minor. Anything you do once, you can do twice. Let's see if that applies to this particular power play. They won that draw. So much of a power play is confidence. When you have a little success, you feel like you can do it again. That's what they should feel after they've already pocketed one power play goal. Stole that pass at a critical end of the ice. Propelled to Besser. A shot. Can't think of a better save than that. Wow, look at him. He's got a long way to go. Does he have enough gas? He shuts it right down. Pass attempt to Beagle. Gathered up again by Eric Stahl. Great job in his own end with that interception. Point blast. Bounced off the boards to Edler. The Canucks are back even. Lost it, but got it back. That hit somebody. Trying to go to Berchi. Oh, snaps the shot. Oh, stick save. That one's right on his stick on the right side. A big hit in open ice. Another reason to like this game tonight. That's why coaches tell you at every level, you've got to have your head up. The pad flashed out to turn that aside. Up the wing, moving along. Shoots that pass ahead. Shoots one. No! Got to get it on net. Oh, that's a great scoring chance. He's shaking his head now because he knows all he had to do was hit the net on the one-timer, but he shot it over top. Has it back deep. Laid on to Pedersen. Puck is thrown to Miko Koivu. A point hammer shot. Chuck that right away. Coley's looking around the screen to try to find the puck. And he slides it on through the middle. Smart recovery by Ryan Suter. Pitching it to Fiala. And a save there. Takes his pass from the goalie. Pitching this one to Pearson. And he gains the zone. Keeps it in the zone with that interception. Quick shot. At least he protected his goaltender. Big shot from the point. Oh, what a block. Great offensive job here. Means score!
Under nine minutes still showing on the clock this period. Whoa, and one guy's really hot right now, and maybe it'll be two. Well, this is where you might be looking to change the momentum of this game here, Doc, and we'll see if anything else takes place after that. Takes that one, an outstanding pass through center ice. Good intercept. And a save. Slid to Erickson Eck. And now it's directed by Hutton. And it's a good pickup. On to Stetcher. Moving it to Sutter. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Tries to get it on net. Blocked. A point hammer shot. That puck was obstructed by a screen. Didn't get a thing of that. Takes a shot. Puck's loose off the enemy this time. And the puck heads to the neutral zone, and so everybody has to get reset. Got it on his stick in the slot. Wonderful stop. Looking to Erickson. The Canucks starting back in their own end. Vancouver's, wow, what a hit. What a mean-spirited hit. And he'll be taken to task for that one. They have just four players on the ice. Their fifth is slow to his feet and back to the bench. He's hurt. Somebody over early also. Guys, bull jarring hit here. He was hurt immediately. Canucks win the draw. What's next? Oh, what a hit that one was. I like that he's trying to create space by throwing the body around. This is a way to change momentum in a in hockey game. Covers and stops play. Dubnik's far and away been the best player in this hockey game. He has faced an inordinate amount of shots in this contest, stopped just about everything, and as a result, he's got to be the first star as his team is leading this game. Dings it off the iron. Missed all of it. Directing that one to Erickson. Couldn't make it through, can't retain possession. Gathered up again by Spurgeon. Driving in from no man's land. Works it along with a pass off the boards. Snapping a pass to Edler. Can't take an offside here. Everybody goes back. Dogged determination there by Brodine. Nice work by Raz. A shot. Outstanding body contact. Oh, that's a big hit, Bob. On a night where things haven't been going very well, he's doing whatever he can to get something positive for his team. And that's it. The game is over. Don't know if the turning point in this was at the anthem or shortly thereafter. Not much of a game for one team. I think it was when the puck dropped.